What's up, everybody? Matthew, my real life TV 505, and I'm back. And I got a new T-shirt. I really like this T-shirt. <laughs> it says "Legalize Cannabis, Educate, Regulate, Educate, Medicate." I got picked this up over at Birdland over in Knob Hill. Had to, I had to get it. Just it represents everything that I that I that I love. So today, I'm here with you guys to do um, a little video about cartridges and vaping. So as you guys have seen in the media lately, there's been a lot of negative talk about cartridge, cartridge, THC cartridges and vaping um, being linked to to mysterious illnesses and deaths. Well, I, I want to make a little bit of a clarification for everybody out there because here's something the media is not doing. They're not researching. They're not disclosing certain information. And what they're doing is they're basically trying to black eye the business. Not even the business. They're just trying to black eye the trying to black eye the medical cannabis field. So what I want to what I want to make clear out there is that they they are talking about street cartridges. Now, mind you, not talking about a cartridge that you pick up at a medical dispensary. They're talking about THC cartridges that you pick up off the street illegally cut. So, here's the thing. Street dealers are doing the same thing that they've done forever with drugs when it's come to drug to, to anything on the street not just like drugs or cannabis or whatever it's it's crazy so back when there was cocaine of course drug drug dealers found a way to step on it cut it turn it into crack make it into more money heroin they found a way to take it cut it with some other things and make it into more money what the street has done and i got a hold of one of these through the streets a few months back and i've been saving it to show people this bullshit right here. Dank vape. This is fake vape. Don't get this crap. It's disgusting. It's cut. And it's going to get you sick. This shit comes off the street. And people are selling this at dirt cheap prices. For like $10 a freaking cart. Now just because it's cheap. Or less expensive. Doesn't mean it necessarily mean it's quality. I want you guys to take a good hard look at this thing. Look how dark that is. Look how crappy it is. You turn that upside down. Look at that bubble. Look at that bubble start moving. You see that bubble rising there? That means this stuff has been stepped on, it's been cut, and there's crap in it. Pesticides, vitamin E oils, nicotine, e-juice, stuff like that. This is garbage. Don't buy this stuff, guys. Don't do it. So, what I did is I went into a few dispensaries and I bought a few different cartridges. I bought a Butter Pros, which as you can see, I've already used that one all up. Now look at this pure, just the concentrated oil there it doesn't move it doesn't it's stuck there i went and i bought a brand new cart and i went over to ultra health at the bird at birdland up in knob hill and here's what i like i picked up one of their cartridges and their in-house cartridges they extract them out of their own plants from their farm up north so this is their stuff right here their own as you can see look how clean that oil is look how clean look how pure this is 100 percent pure distillate oil THC. It does have terpenes that have been extracted from the flower and added back into the cartridge to give you more flavor and more of your medical benefits of the terpenes. So of course we've talked about terpenes before and that's how you want to buy your flower for your medicine. Same thing with the cartridges. This one right here is called Black Lime. It's a half gram. It's a, it's a hybrid. And I'm going to try this cartridge out. So what you do you go ahead and you take off these little protective covers here. You put it into your 5 tenths thread battery. And you load that up right there. Look at it. Just look how clean this oil is, guys. Just look. I mean, look at this oil compared to this shit. Literally, shit. This right here. Clean. 100% pure distillate oil. Look at the bubble on this one. That baby does not move anywhere. Does not move. That's how you know that this is 100% oil. THC and terpene. Mm. It's very smooth flavor. This is a good quality cart right here. Smooth. It has a very delightful taste to it. 
and as you can see you have nothing to worry about no nothing cut in here nothing added N no no bullshit no bullshit 100% right here <coughs> so I recommend when you go in to buy cartridges don't get your shit off the street get off that crap stop being cheap get your cannabis card get your medical card stop treating this like it's a recreational thing and go in there and you buy yourself 100% pure cannabis oil with terpene specific terpenes extracted for specific medical need that's what the media is not telling you these are street carts that are hurting people and making people sick not medical carts all right you want to do it right then do it right or don't do it at all you'll have to pay for it later while we're on the topic of vaping I went through to Everest of course and I bought me a PAX era how many of you guys have heard of the PAX that's right it's a new way new form of vaping here's the cool thing about it you can connect this to your smartphone to your Apple phone whatever and you can control the temperature on your you can control the temperature on your phone as to how you want to burn your oil as you can see I got this right here and this is the cartridge that it pretty much comes with I've been smoking on this for a couple of weeks now and uh you know I've been sharing it with with Natasha she's also a patient and it's lasting really long. I mean, the battery life on it is amazing, too. I've charged it once in, like, the last two weeks. It hits so smooth. And then the, the way you burn it, so when you set up your burning on your on your smartphone, you set up the, uh, the temperature you want to burn it at, the lower the temperature, you're still going to get a good hit, but you get more of the flavor of, of your cart. So I picked up an Arise cartridge. It's a sativa. I really like the flower of it. And so I was like, well, hell, I want to put that onto my packs because I like Arise. I like Sativa. I love Heyday Cannabis Oil. It's smoother. It tastes great. I feel like you get a bigger, like a bigger hit out of it. And you don't have to rip it. That's the nice thing about it. You don't rip these. You sip them. You just sip it. That easy. And the thing is this, I can't rip it too much because the other day I, I ripped it like a dozen times in a row. Like not ripped, but like sipped. I should say I sipped it like a dozen times in a row. And bro, I was oof, I was blown. I was gassed. I'm telling you right now, just off of hitting this a few times, I could already see that that I'm, that I'm feeling the effects of it. Getting the stony effect. And this this is great. If I recommend, if anybody, if you're looking to transition from the traditional battery pack and cartridge to something a little bit more... That lasts a little bit longer, has more battery life, a lot more durable. So you drop these, not going to shatter, crack, or break. Um, I really enjoy the way you can control the temperature for what you're burning at on your phone. So that is awesome. So the lower you burn it, the longer it can last too. So if you get a chance, yeah, no mess, complete control, ultimate selection, and you get a peace of mind with this thing knowing that it's secure. You can even lock this up on your phone. You can lock it up so nobody can rip it. So for safety reasons, like let's say you leave it out on the kitchen table, you lock it on your phone. Nobody can just come up and try to hit this. Nobody can take your med. No one can hit your medicine. Um, it has games on it, which is really cool too. You can. It has different kinds of games. When you shake it, it activates it to your phone, and you can play things like Simon Says. You can play like Ch Chase the Light stuff like that. Little stoner games. But anyways. This is just a quick video that I wanted to throw at you guys. If you get a chance, pick up a PAX. Try it out. It's a new new way of vaping. I personally enjoy it. I did find a PAX 2 and 3 at Verdes. Now, PAX 3, you can do dry herb and concentrate. So that's going to be next on my wish list. Um, so for today, guys, I really appreciate you taking the time ahead of time for listening to me about the safety of vaping and cartridges. And I uh, just want to let you know when it when it comes to when it comes to vaping and it comes to getting your cartridges, don't get this shit off the street. Don't be cheap. Get some good quality medical cannabis cartridges. All right. I picked up mine over at Ultra Health and at Birdland, same place where I picked up this T-shirt. Great friendly staff. I will be going there again, um, especially because they hit it up with this big list of specials that they have throughout the week. So y'all grab a look at that. And uh, again, thank you guys. 
Thank you guys ahead of time for taking the time, and I really look forward to the future. Thank you.